This is the road that uh, leads to the Bole International Airport in Addis Ababa. On a normal day, this roundabout would be full of traffic, with people running into the airport and others uh, coming out after being picked from their flights. But now it is a bit calm, really calm uh, uh, for, for a normal day. And this is because Ethiopian Airlines tells us that uh, it has suspended international flights to at least 80 destinations. And most of these destinations are countries that have said they do not want flights into their countries or leaving their countries as a way of preventing uh, the spread of COVID-19. But here within the country also, Ethiopian Airlines has cut uh, flights to its local destinations by about half, 50% of flights, in domestic flights now, now happening. Now, in terms of uh, the safety of the crew members, that has been one thing that has been raised by citizens around here. How safe are the crew members? And Ethiopian Airlines has said that uh, it has been doing uh, regular screening of uh, the people who go on different uh, flights uh, to ensure that they are okay, their temperatures are okay. And in terms of protective gear, the airline says it has used at least half a million masks and gloves uh, in different destinations that it has flown to. And it says it still has a stock of 300,000 masks and gloves. And right behind me, the white building uh, with blue windows is uh, the Skylight Hotel. It is owned by Ethiopian Airlines. It is one of the designated quarantine centers. And we understand that there are some people who have been quarantined in there at their own cost, as the government had instructed. Now, if, if I turn just uh, to my farther left, you see there are very many cars that have been parked here. It is a long line that stretches right from the other side to this other side. Now, right at the end of this line is a petrol station. There has been some shortage of, petro I mean, of uh, fuel, gas and fuel in the country, uh, especially in the city. People do not understand why. We are waiting for the government to explain why. Is it an artificial shortage or is it directly related to COVID-19? And the city has also been uh, doing some spraying around different parts of the city that are considered congested. And the mayor of the Addis Ababa city administration says that uh, it is a way of creating awareness on the residents about the, the need to prevent themselves from COVID-19, but also a way of cleaning up the air. Colette Anjohi, SABC News, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.